monkey. And uh, anyway, look at look at the camera so people can see you. There you go. First off, I don't even want to know about why they call you Monkey King. I want to know about what happened to your glasses. Free running. <laughs> so I'm free running. Yeah. How many people ask you why your glasses is broke? Okay, it's too many to count. Too many to count? There's a lot of people. Is it getting annoying to the point where you basically wanna, where you basically wanna get some new glasses? Nope. Why not? Because it's me. It's my style. That's this me. That that's your style. Is that, I don't. It doesn't bother me. All right. Okay. It, it honestly doesn't bother me. All right. So so explain your relationship with Team Impulse. Tell me why you got into free running and, and why you connect so much with free running. It's, it's like. Like the name says, it's free running. It's just everything is just free, free movement. It's yeah. exciting. <laughs> it's like the greatest, like one of the greatest feelings ever. Like you free run, and like your move, the movement and everything is just so good. It's like yeah. on top of everything else, the way you move, yeah. Yeah. so awesome. It's like okay, for example, doing different moves for free runners, you put it in your own way. The way you do your move makes your moves unique yeah, and it's just so great. Yeah. yeah, one of the things I know about you is you're really creative. So tell me about the creative aspects about free running. Tell me tell me tell me why it's creative. Uh, it's like basically it's like okay, you teach you the bit like, and you learn the basics, you use the basics in everyday free running. Yeah. After everything, you use it in your way. Well, how the way that makes you feel comfortable. You know, you know, you're doing like the regular thing, what you have to do. Yeah. But when you do it in your way, it feels more comfortable. You feel more relaxed doing it, and everything is better. You met the you met the founder of, of parkour, right? One of them. One of them. How, I mean, what was his name, and, and what did you guys talk about? What did you guys talk? About? Sebastian Foucault. Like Sebastian Fox or something like that. Yeah, what'd you talk about? Um, when I met him, we talked about like, okay, I was asking him, what helps you free run? Like, what do you do before every competition? And like, if you can help me with some moves. <laughs> yeah. What What did he teach you? Or um, he teach me how. He told me how to do a wall front flip. Yeah. That I did one time, and apparently I'm terrified to do it again. If If you had to do one move that you're fucking scared to do. And, and you could just overcome it right now, what would that move be? It would be the wall front flip, but as much as I want to do it, I'm still terrified of doing it. Is it oh, why? Why is that? Yeah, uh, it's like, okay, doing a wall, like a front flip, it's <laughs> like um, you run up the wall and you front, you're literally pushing off the wall one foot to front flip. That is scary. On top of that, it's concrete. All right. And, and what if, if you had to do one move that you would call your signature move? What would that be? Um, the one like that you kick ass spin. most. The, the what? That front flip spin. Why is that? You do a front flip and you spin. Cause like okay, when I'm doing moves, it's fun spinning. Yeah. That's how like it doesn't get me dizzy that much. So it's like doing moves that that's do with spinning is like one of the greatest things ever. If you had to say one thing to to the people that want to be free runners but haven't began yet, what would that one thing be? Join us, Team Impulse. Leave it at All that. Join right. us, Team Impulse. Yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, come on, Team Impulse. Right here. <laughs> and join us. Yeah. Ah. Join us. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay. I want to be in it. Apparently, Waffle still doesn't have that. Team Impulse. Right here. <laughs>